Well, hello there, everybody. How are we all doing tonight? Welcome to Spirit Tea. My name is Rain, your host as always. I was concerned the music stopped playing. <laughs> but they still sound, so we're good. It's okay. We're all right. Give me a minute. I've actually been looking forward to this game. It seems super cute. I know I'm not looking at you yet. I'm sorry. I'm still kind of setting up. Hold tight. Not with the string. Internet better be fine tonight. Anyway. Anyway. Making sure I could be heard. Let's get into it while I simultaneously figure out my shit. New save data, please. Oh, lots of sounds. Where am I? Welcome. What stop will you be getting off at? Uh... Let's go with that! Limburg, huh? This bus indeed stops there. But you're in for a long ride. You'd best get comfortable, haha! <laughs> I kind of like that face better. Can I have blue hair? I don't want to be bald. Let's go with that hair. I didn't know we got to make our own character like this. I actually like that. Green shorts. I need like the whitest white. Actually, that one works. Fantasy author, huh? Yes. I'm in the summer of 29. It only goes to 28. <gasps> Wait, so if I get to pick my own birthday, then I'm picking fall 17. We know what my name is. I like these sounds. Rain! That's me! <clears throat> Excuse me. Right then, take a seat. Let's let everybody else on the bus now, eh? Okie dokie. I'm so cute. Look at that. I like it. Already. I actually have eyebrows today. I took a walk. I had a nice walk, too. Walked around downtown where I live. Aww. This is such a cute game already. Thank you. 
Must be rain. Glad you made it in one piece. I suppose proper introductions are in order. My name is Miko. I believe we spoke on the phone the other day. She's so cute. Welcome to Limburg. It's really quite lovely here. I do hope you'll enjoy the time you spend here. We received all of your luggage earlier today. I had my husband Quill help me get it safely to the house you'll be staying in. I'm afraid I may have sullied his first impression of you. Because I had him carry the heavy things. Oh. Speaking of, let me quit yapping and show you to your home. This way, please. Oh, look at the froggies. They're so cute. Well, what do you think? I have to clear something else out real quick. I know you can see it, don't worry. Close, 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 close. Well, what do you think? Sorry. Looks nice. Oh, I'm just teasing you. This is my home. Just remember the red roof if you ever need to see either myself or Quill. Not now. Oh, okay. This here is my husband's bike bicycle shop. You might find it convenient to have a bicycle if you ever want to explore the nearby area. At the very least, a little exercise does the body some good. <laughs> I was trying to figure out how to take screenshots without controller, because I did download it through Xbox on PC. So. <laughs> Anywho. Hope y'all are ready. Dig in. As you can see, this is pretty much the extent of our downtown here in Limburg. Sure, it's nothing like the big city you've just come from. We've got everything we need. There's a restaurant if you're tired of cooking at home, a karaoke bar, a chicken restaurant, coffee shop, and Kenzo runs a convenience store a little ways southeast of here. I could talk your ear off about all the restaurants here, and how kind they all are. But Quill did warn me that you've had a long trip, and to, um, <clears throat> keep your yapping to a minimum and let the newbie sleep. So let's get you home. Well, it's okay, Miko. You're lovely. Keep talking to me. You're my first friend. Already I'm in love. <laughs> at my house and here we are do you hope it meets all of your needs the pictures i posted online were taken just last week so it should all be accurate oh one thing you might find different so we tend to leave our doors unlocked we don't usually have any crime here but there have been strange occurrences lately and well there aren't that many of us living in town what I'm trying and failing to say is that Limburg is very safe, that I sincerely hope you enjoy this slice of the countryside. Feel free to visit your neighbors where and whenever you please. I know they'll be happy to get to know you. Then I'll leave you to it. I set up your futon this morning. You should have everything you need. 
I saw you had an old teapot in the cupboard. Maybe you can try out some of the locally grown tea. Okay, I'm leaving now because even I can tell I've nattered on for too long. Good night. Good night, Miko. I love you. You're amazing. <clears throat> Miko is perfect in every way. <laughs> okay, I've got to explore my little house. It's been a long day. Interact with the bed. The game is saved every time you sleep. I wanted to explore though. Boo. That's okay. A visitor already? Jeez. Who's got here? Uh. Ah, you must be Rain. <laughs> Don't look so surprised. Miko has already told me all about you. She's not really one to keep gossip to herself. Anyway, I'm Amelia, the other town granny. It's a pleasure to meet you. Hi. Okay, random hair in my mouth. <clears throat> I come, came by because I wanted to welcome you to our little town. Drop off a few things. First off, in case you're hungry. Ooh, ice ball! Yummy. That rice ball is from an old family recipe called Rice Ball from the Convenience Store. I'm gonna do it. <laughs> you can eat that delicious morsel by pressing left shift, which is great for restoring stamina, but why don't you set that down on the table there for now, because I've got something else for you. For my rice bowl. Now, this here is from Miko. Ooh, mixed veggies, egg, and rice. Yum. She forgot to give it to you last night. You don't have to eat it now if you don't want to. Why don't you throw it in that backpack of yours? But wait, that's not all. I saw someone say that on television. I was just trying to be flashy. I brought you a brochure of the activities that you can do around Limburg. It comes with a map too, which I'm sure you'll find useful. Okay. Oh, cool. <laughs> I'm actually curious if that captured the full screen. Hmm. I'll figure it out later. This is so cute! Look at everything dancing! What does it say? Windows, alt, print screen. Jeez. I'm learning about this widget. Okay, that's cool. I like that map. <clears throat> and with all that, you should be good to go, but, um... You're right, or correct? It doesn't look like you've got a place to sit and work. I wonder if we might have something in storage over at the shop. It's my daughter's store, but I help out every now and then. Why don't we head over there and see if she's got an old desk that you could use? All of this is just so exciting. I don't understand when you're an old fart like me. Yeah, okay. The shop is nice and close to your new home. Just walk a little ways east and you're there. Let's go! A couple more things. You can open and close your backpack by pressing F. Lift shift to run. East is this way, right? Oh, nice. Look at the froggies! 
Oh, they're so precious! Shop! I don't know, could this be it? I think I hear some busy upstairs. Actually, I was supposed to be watching over the shop when I snuck over to your place. Let me go ask her if she's got a desk that you can use. Okay, cool. Hi. Hey, you must be the newbie. I'm Moby. I run a coffee shop a little northwest of here. Feel free to stop by for your caffeine-fueled needs. I thought I was running a bath. Rain, seems like we've got a desk here for you. Oh, Moby, could you help Rain out and bring it over to their place? Yeah, sure thing. Thanks. Thank you, dear. I'd better get back to running the shop, Rain. Don't worry about the desk. I'm just happy to see it be of use to someone. Okay. Whew, what a workout. Where do you want this thing? Unless, of course, you like it sitting in the middle of your room. Move it to wherever you want, using your house organizer. It's over there between your front doors. I actually kind of like it. How do I rotate it? Can I rotate it? Okay. All set? Perfect. Not my rice bowl! Give it back! <gasps> did, did you see that? You, you did? Thank the gods. Thought I was losing it for a second there. Listen, Rain. I'm not sure if anyone has mentioned this to you, but Limburg kind of feels haunted at times. It ate my rice ball! I was looking forward to that. Like, Sujin was telling me the other day that she's been hearing some strange noises outside her boat at night time. And in my own apartment, I've got these, like, weird plants growing around my bathtub. Sounds pretty strange. Right? I mean, I clean this tub all the time. Weird things shouldn't be growing out of it. Anyway, your food was just floating, then disappeared in front of us. It's like this place is... Wait, don't open it. It might be trying to bring its friends. Wait. Could be trying to get out. Quickly, open it! Sorry to intrude. My name is Young. I run the temple at the southern tip of the town. Hey! I wanted to be one of the first to welcome you to Limburg. I hope that... Moby, are you unwell? Young! So good to see you, buddy. All is well over here. <laughs> How very curious. Anyway, Rain, you likely haven't had much of a chance to explore the town and meet everyone just yet, have you? I had a word with my associate, Jan, this morning, and she's agreed to help you find and meet all of the locals. Jan? You mean, she's a wonderful companion, I think. Two of you will get along swimmingly. She's waiting for you just outside whenever you're ready. Oh, okay, then. I guess I'll leave you to it, Rain. Be careful not to let Jan bite you. <laughs> Don't worry about that. She's very kind. Cat, isn't it? Enjoy your day. I'll stop by later to pick up Jan once you've familiarized yourself with the town. She doesn't like to be away from her brother Maru for long. Game has just been saved. Ordinarily, this game only saved when you sleep. What's a doggy? Hi. Will you be my friend? <clears throat> Let's 
Excuse me. Froggies! <gasps> Reflections. Oh, that's so cool. Wait for me, Popper. I can't pick that. I wanted to pick that. Thank you, Jan. Oh, you're a new face in town. Hey, I'm Bruce. You must be a new resident in town. It's a pleasure to finally meet you. My name is Clarence. Good job. There's Eric. Still doing. Hmm. You're the new face in town, huh? My name's Ling. Be seeing you around. Is it him? Maybe? Hi! I don't think we've met. I'm Kim. Nice to meet you, Kim. Maybe if I go outside, it'll fix the dog. Hi! You must be Rain. Whole town is talking about you. Oh! I'm Yumi. Nice to meet you, Yumi. Is there anyone upstairs? I don't know what the hell is wrong with my dog. Going in there. For you. Toby. Hey, I'm Toby. I don't think we've met before. No, we have not, sir. I'm brand new. This is my first day here. Let's see if there's anyone in the bathroom. See if there's anyone in here. Nope. And nope. Okie dokie. This game is adorable. Oh, now you want to show me where people are. What in the heck? Where'd the dog go? Oh, hi. Where are you? You must be Rain. I'm Faye. The local carpenter, blacksmith, all around her. Where'd the dog go? Never be afraid to get your hands a little dirty. Oh, well, that's Meeple. I found your bathroom. Were you looking for it? Oh, your house is so cute. Thank you. Dog did it. New in town, huh? I'm Kenzo. I work at the only convenience store in town. I'm sure I'll see you during your snack runs. Not creepy at all. Hey, you just moved into that place by the water? Oh, I'm Eric. Okay, cool. Thanks. Bye. Excuse me. Who 
hiccups. Stairs? Little apartments! Hey, I'm Gail. I work at the karaoke bar down in town. Let's see who else is in here, huh? No one in here. Kitty! I see you, kitty! You're adorable! Love the kitties! Is there another upstairs? How tall is this building? Remind me. An aquarium? It's so cool. Aquariums are hard work. I used to have one. Had African cichlids. Amazing fish, by the way. Beautiful. Is that it? First floor, please. Oh, so many people. Tifa? You know how I feel about Tifa. Just saying. Doggo. Hi! So you're the new face in town, huh? I'm Tifa. I take care of the tea fields here in town. Oh, come see me tomorrow. I'll give you a free sample. This game is delightful. Where'd the dog go? <laughs> just kind of went exploring on my own. Okay. Thank you. Where's Tara? Mulan feels. Coffee! Ooh, a couple people are meeting here. Oh, hey! I'm Sujin. Must be the newbie in town. Oh, who's this beautiful beast I see? I'm Tara. I live at the pension drop down by the southeastern beach. Okay, cool. Thanks. Bye. Hi, Owl. Oh, there's so many people. <gasps> there's a cat I can meet? What? Yeah, okay. I'm not trying to. I'm trying to talk to the dog. <laughs> Dog moves fast. Mm. Must be the new kid. I'm Song. This little mister here is Momo. Meeting everybody. Doing this. Show me the kitty. I gotta see the kitty. See it. Inside? Oh, hi. Ah, oh, so you're the one Miko was talking about. Hmm. Welcome. And all that. 
Where's your cat? I just gotta meet Maru. Ah! Dog, come back! I'm lost without you! Okay. Oh, almost lost it there. <laughs> Okay, where the hell? Oh, the puppies! Inside the shop? No. This is pretty spirit wandering into our little town. Rain, is it? And I'll be Lee. Okay. Oh my gosh. Oh, there's only two people left. It's fine. <coughs> Excuse me. Damn it, dog. <laughs> How do I lose you so easily? Is he going to be in here? Yep. Good stuff. Oh, hi! Hmm? Who are you supposed to be? Me? Julian. What's up to you? Okay, sorry, bro. She's in there, too. Okie dokie. Thank you! Are you new around here? I don't think I've met you before. My name's Jillian. Pleased to meet you. I met everybody! Foot just got stuck on my fucking pants. <clears throat> Excuse me. You look like you both have had a long day. Hope your first impression of our little town has been a good one. Oh, that reminds me. Tifa wanted me to tell you to pick up some tea leaves from her tomorrow. Anyway, stop by the temple anytime. Jen, Maru, and I all enjoy visitors. Our doors are always open. Come on, Jen. Okay, thanks. Bye. Oh, this is my bat. So cool. Yes. Take bath. Yes. Okay, cool. Thanks. Bye. Oh, sleepies. What's that on the... Oh, you can't see it. Raining. Love it. Hey, who are you? Excuse me. Oh, you're Lee. Ah, there you are. As promised. Here. I do want to look around a bit. I saw stuff laying on the ground before in bushes. Okay, maybe not. But it's a really nice tree. Is stuff not going to be there now? Oh, the hermit crabs! They're so cute! 
Hey, who's this? Man. Did I meet this person? I can't remember. Oh yeah, I did. Okie dokie. It sounds so cool. What is that? Okay. Gelberry, thumb fruit, and butterfruit. Nice. Love it. So, where's... Okay, that is my door. It's like, wait, where is my door? Teepees! What? I do, too! It said I got some. What? Didn't we just get tea leaves from what's her name? I swear we did. How am I? Okay. Didn't we literally just get tea leaves from her? That's what I did. I don't have any tea leaves. What the heck? I'm so confused. It just said we got tea leaves from her. How can I sell things? Can I sell things? So confused. Well, I mean, I kind of like to know. I'm confused. I'm really confused. Oh. 
Well, where's my tea leaves? I can cook? That's so cool. So, did I drop the tea leaves then, or? Bird. Hi, poppers. I'm so confused. Did I eat them on accident? <laughs> Did I just steal Teely? I think I did. Ah! What are you? What the hell was that? Okay, cool. What do I have here then? Okay. Doesn't make any sense, but all right. Where did my tea leaves go then? I didn't get any tea leaves. I'm so confused. No, ma'am. So, like, you guys can't see it, but right underneath the chat box down here, there's, like, this dragon bell-looking thing. What's this over here? So, where did my tea leaves go, then? She gave me tea leaves. Now they're gone. Is that them? Oh, wait. Jade Duck. Hmm? What is 
see, sir. Did I smush the bug? Okay, I don't know if so. No! Go! There they are, okay? That I'm so confused. <laughs> so confused. What the hell? Is that a slug? What are you? Okay, fine. Had to have been a bug. Yep, figured that out now. Okay. Oh, it's heating up supernaturally. That's so. Okay. What was it? Hang on. Window, alt, screen. Okay. Added tea and water to the teapot. It seems to be heating up supernaturally. Should I be worried? I think I should be worried. Just saying. Drink the spirit tea. Okay. Trying to figure this out. Okay. Drink the spirit tea. Ooh. Stupid, feeble creatures. So selfish. Leaving me. Huh? Boy, you can see me? You can, can't you? This, this is. I'm supposed to be guiding. <gasps> Kitty! How long was I? I can't believe that even I became lost. May, never let me live this one down. Wait, who the heck are you? Rain. Anyway, doesn't matter. We've got problems. We? Yes, we. You live here now, don't you? This town is crawling with troublemaking spirits. They're what's called lost because humans have stopped worshipping, leaving offerings, or even thinking about them anymore. Fortunately, not as weak as those other fools, though I nearly lost control. Anyway, you can call me Wanyan. Since you appear to be somewhat spiritual, you're going to help me get things under control around here. What? Ah. Okay. 
Sure. What's with that look? You didn't come here to mess about with spirits. I get it. You mortals live short lives. Fill each day with things that bring you happiness. Truth is, I... No. We need you. Damn it. You're really going to make me beg? There are already so many lost spirits who don't even remember who they were. You don't... They don't... They need your help. Come on, brain. Fuck. Mortals like being called heroes, don't you? Fine, I'll help you. That's more like it. I think I have a plan that just might work, but first, you need to see something. Let's head up the mountain. Look for the stairs at the eastern part of town. Okay. Wait. That way. Where am I? No. I think I went the right way. Oh wait, that is... Okay. Yeah. It's this one. Okay. There you go. Go figure. <laughs> there we go. Hey, who are you? <coughs> I found the stairs, Wanyan. Send the mountain, huh? Should I be worried? I feel like I should be worried. This is, well, used to be a bathhouse for spirits. They would come from far and wide to enjoy the purifying waters of the mountain. Spiritual people such as yourself used to look after the spirits and run the bathhouse, but it's not all for charity. These spirits would in turn offer some of their wealth they receive from their shrines throughout the world. As you can see, the bathhouse has been abandoned. The last bathhouse keeper was a spunky girl. In fact, she used to live in the house you've just moved into. I don't know how long she's been gone. Aww. The spirits need you to become the next keeper of the bathhouse. Otherwise, they'll become more and more lost and cause more and more havoc to the people of Limburg. Why me? Don't kid yourself. It didn't have to be you. Anyone with a lick of spirituality would have done. But you did come, and you can help everyone. Spirits and people alike. So you're in then. Good. I'm glad we're all on the same team. Then, if we're meaning to get this place up and running, we'll need to first open her up. If I'm not mistaken, I left the key with a spirit who has a fondness for sweets. Find the spirit. We'll find the key. Though whether or not you'll be able to see the spirit is questionable. I can deal with that later. For now, let's head to a place with a lot of sweet foods. Uh, look, I don't even know where that is. I'm still new. Look. have space? I have space. 
Ooh, what's this? It's locked. Well! It really is kind of spirited away. I like it! What's over here? What are all those? I don't think I have a lemon. I don't think I have any of that. I'm still new. I got a sun melon. Oh, did it get put in there? Oh. Yes. Eat it. Yum, yum, yum. Right, so what is this? Seed bag. It's somewhere that has lots of sweets. Where would that be? Uh. What's that? All these paths. Oh. Okay. I hope you realize I don't actually know where I'm going. I'm still mute. It's not you. What place would have a bunch of sweets? This is my house. Maybe a convenience store? Is this it? No, that's not it. This is karaoke. Here? No. Just coffee. Coffee shop. This was restaurant.
place. Where was the convenience store? It's the bike shop. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> As a coughing fit hits me. Where's the school? Where the heck was... It's a house. It's getting dark. Alright. Pick it back up in the morning. Fireflies! Scared of them, but I like them. You know how big they are? They're huge! Sleep for one hour? Okay, whatever you say. Is it going? Oh, it is going. I'm fermenting things. Okay. Happy sane. I'm very curious. I have no idea what I'm making. Should I be worried? I probably should be. It's already looking questionable. Is it done? What do I make? Junk. How many tea leaves? I'm going to sleep for one hour? No. Okay. I'm at my house. There's a shop. Okay. See if I can figure out how to get over there. Betting I can't. Well, this is. Will this be the place? Hmm. This place looks promising. Try using your spirit vision now. Ancient teapot. Oh, not bad, mortal. Seem to be figuring it out pretty quickly. Now then, let's find the spirit. Here they are. I found them. Oh no, that one. I haven't tried the one with caramel yet. Oh, that one is so good. Hey, check out this mortal. They almost look like watching. I knew I'd be able to find you if I thought my stomach. Thought with my stomach like you always do. It's the fuzz. Let's cheese it. What in the world? Don't just stand there. Catch them. I'll use what little power I have to help you 
keep your spirit vision active. Okay. Let's go. I'm trying. What are you doing, you lunatics? We just want to talk to you. I had them. You better hope we don't catch you now. You've gone ticked me off. Fun time's over, clown car. Revert back now. Oh, hello, Rusty Boy. Welcome in, my friend. What the hell is wrong with you two? Who? One, Yan? Which one of you peanut brains has the key to the bathhouse? Key. Key. Remember, one, Yan, and the key. Gonna be better start talking. Oh, they're so cute! I have the key! I remember now. I'm called Father Rog. And I was known as Aram. This game is so adorable! Wanyan! Oh, I'm so sorry. I failed you, my lord. Seems I forgot who I was. I never forgot your task for me. I've kept the key safe all these years. Here, you must be the new keeper of the baths. Yay! We got the key! Why were you holding it up like that? Can't everyone act normal for just a moment, please? As for you two, this mortal here named Rain, correct, has agreed to get the bathhouse up and running again. I expect to see much of you and your kind there regularly. Yes, of course, one man, sir. We'll be there. With friends. With friends, of course. Ah, you changed your name. Well, nice to see you back. <laughs> Gods be damned. Those fools gave us the runaround, didn't they? <laughs> well, whenever you're ready, let's head to the bathhouse on the mountain. See what condition she's in. Shouldn't we, like, go to bed first? It's... Eleven at night. I also need monies. I don't have monies yet. That's the shop. Going all right. I am a free person again. In other words, I left my day job. <laughs> sleep for one hour. No, I want to sleep through the night. definitely been amazing having free time again. Uh, where were those stairs? Where's the froggy staircase? It's right here? No. It's way the hell over here. Oh, I was trying to go to bed. You only wanted to let me sleep for an hour. Oh. Is it going to have a cutoff like uh, Stardew does? I hope not. 
This is the most free time I've had in almost 10 years. <laughs> That's been super nice. We have a filthy bathhouse. Oh my lord. Ah, yes. This brings back memories. You have no idea how important this place is, Rain. The spirits around here are in bad shape. Probably can't see most of them just yet. But believe me when I say they're up to no good. And unfortunately, it's the townsfolk who are suffering for it. Right. So with those happy thoughts in mind, how about we start doing something about it? Ah, fun, fun, fun. Good stuff. First things first. I didn't catch the rest of what he said. <laughs> Welcome to the bathhouse. It was built centuries ago and has served as a sanctuary for spirits ever since. One thing you've probably noticed is that you can see me without even using your spirit vision. It's not entirely known why spirits can be seen here, but it likely has something to do with the very rare tree that was planted in the courtyard of this structure. Over, t over time, the tree grew to be to enormous proportions and has exerted its special properties upon the building. Anyway, enough of the history lesson. You're here to keep the bathhouse running smoothly and to guide our essentially customers to their spots in the baths. Spirits will pay you depending on their bathing experience, which can be affected by many things, including follow me, Whoa. including water temperature. This is the boiler for all of the baths in the room above us. You have to keep this thing burning so the baths can stay hot. Your source fuel for this baby is right here. Cut a chunk of this tree root for fuel. Hold E when facing. Okay. Aww. I get it, though. Ooh, I learned how to suck. And voila! The tree magically regrows its root. Whoa, that's cool. I'm sure the tree doesn't like you doing this. But bathhouse keepers have cut the same root over and over for centuries. And this is just a hunch, but it seems like the tree is doing just fine. One thing to note is that this root's ability to regrow depends on the spiritual presence of this whole area. What I mean is, the more spirits we track down and smack sense into, the more healthy the spirit tree becomes, which means more roots regrowing and therefore more mulogs. If you don't see the root regrowing, then you'll probably have to wait. I'm sure it'll be growing again after you've slept or something. Anyway, throw that log and one more into the boiler, and then come meet me upstairs. Okay. I get that. Eh. Said to do that and one more. That is so cool. I had to see it do it. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Good work. Glad to see you can follow simple instructions. With your work ethic and my brains, we can have this place running in no time. Making lots and lots of new locks. <clears throat> anyway, do you see this shrine here? It shows you the bath temperatures. If you see the temperature dropping, then you better head to the boiler and load it up some more. Good. Now it's almost time to ring the bell and let the spirits in. But first, we need to make sure we've got some clean towels to let the spirits use. Makes sense. 
Precisely. I'm glad to see you're starting to grasp how this all works. Come on, let's see if there are any towels still. If we're lucky, they won't be too moldy. I kind of love this. I had a yawn coming. Check that towel box for dirty used towels. When spirits are done with their baths, they will leave their towels in the box on their way out. As you might have guessed, use E while facing the towel bin to check the towels. Good. There are some towels left. Let's go get them cleaned up this way. There's not much light in here. Welcome to the washing kitchen. I suppose we never did come up with a name for it. Let's just call it the prep room. As you can see, things here have also become quite overgrown and unstable. Fortunately, that's not the case for the wash tub and the heating vents. Two, three, four. Excellent. Take those wet towels and start hanging them over. Okay. I get it. Towels will take some time to dry, so it's important to be as efficient as possible. There are always things you can be doing while running the bathhouse. Keep the boiler hot. Cleaning towels, cooking for spirits, when you've hired someone to clean this area up. Scrubbing spirits with a brush. All of these things will affect a spirit's happiness. Therefore, affect how many moolahs they will leave you in thanks. Piece of cake, right? Right. You're a lively one. I can almost smell the moolahs now. Right. Let's bring these dry towels to the bathhouse entry. I mean you. You bring the towels. Can I finish washing them, though? Let's finish washing. I want to finish up the towels. 100% or nothing, remember? God, it's getting cold in here. I might need to put my sweater on. Yay, we got a bunch of clean towels. Are they dry? No visible mold? Perfect. Drop them over on this green bamboo mat. When spirits visit the bathhouse, they will automatically grab a towel from this bamboo towel zone. Make sure you do your best. Always have some fresh towels for the spirits to use. All right, I think we're ready. Ring this bell to open the bathhouse up to spirits. Welcome in. Right on time. You've got your first guest. Take their towel from them and lead them to our only bath that is currently ready. One thing to keep in mind, if you ever don't want to seat a particular spirit, you can always bring the towel back to the entrance. The spirit will leave on their own. Don't recommend doing this often, though. There will be times when a spirit is too large for your baths. It might ruin the bathing experience you've created. In those cases, just give them the boot and they'll come back later. 
Anyway, grab the spirit. Okay. Okay. How do I? Oh, yours. And that's just about all there is to it. You can tell a spirit's mood when standing near them. A happy face means their happiness is improving, whereas an angry face means their happiness is on the decline. Once you've seated a spirit in the bath, they're in there for the duration of their stay. This means if you place a spirit next to a spirit they dislike, then you won't be making as much money as you could be. You could remedy this by making an extra effort to improve that spirit's mood. Back scrubbing, giving food, adding elixirs to the water. Or if you're busy, you can just accept the blunder and move on. The most important thing to know about running a spirit bathhouse is this. Spirits all belong to a particular season. Spirits enjoy sitting near spirits from the season after theirs. On the other hand, spirits dislike sitting near spirits whose season is opposed to theirs. Okay. Confused? Ugh, you would be. Let's have a peanut for a brain. Okay. How about this? If I recall correctly, two spirits we chased around town were spring and fall spirits. So you probably don't want to sit them near each other. Figuring out which spirits belong to which season will take a bit of trial and error. Or, wait, you might be able to consult the old spirit information tomes. Those have likely been buried for centuries. That's one other thing I should mention. Come here for a second. Okay. I noticed it when... The previous bathhouse keeper was taking care of this place. It was Miko, wasn't it? Random scratch on my arm. What the heck? The ancient tree that grew out of the courtyard of this bathhouse seems to react to how pleased the spirits are when they leave after their bath. I've seen this tree root grow as more and more spirits leave after having a fulfilling bath. It's possible something important might happen when the root grows to a certain length. I don't know. Usually more focused on how much money the spirits leave us. Just like you, Baba. <laughs> okay, I'll leave you to figure things out on your own. Ring the bell again if you want to close the bathhouse. Spirits will pay you, pay you not as much as if you let them enjoy their whole bath undisturbed. If you're tired, you can always go home and sleep, which saves the game, whatever that means. Oh, and don't forget to collect your earnings from the money pot by the front entrance when you're done working. Okay, I get some light up in here. We could do this for now. Okay, they all seem happy. Happy, happy. Okay. Another pumpkin head. I'm feeling very tired. Well, I mean. We just got started though. There we go. We're doing all 
right. Yeah. You guys are all happy, happy. Looking good. I can't see it very well. I'm good. I wonder. Will I just pass out if it hits 2 a.m.? Everyone's happy. Happy, happy, happy. No one has left yet, though. So... I should probably close, but... Okay. <clears throat> so are they almost done or Probably go ahead and close for tonight because I've been soaking enough. Yes, please, because I need to go sleepies. I got bunnies! Made a lot for our first night. But we need to go to bed. I can make more tea. Come over here, Rain. I've got something to show. I need to go to bed. Come on. See this board here? This is the town board. It's where the locals like to post all kinds of things. However, most recently I've noticed them posting concerns that are very peculiar. I know this town is crawling with spirits, and I have a feeling that a lot of the concerns posted here could be linked somehow. It's probably a good idea to check this board out periodically. My hunch is correct. Of course it is. Then we'll be able to find many more potential customers for our bathhouse. Okay. I need to go to bed now. Oh, I can control how long I go to sleep. Okay. Cool. About time you got up. Listen up. I thought of something that can help you keep straight all the weirdness going on in Limburg. I was thinking it might be a good idea to write down key information you've heard around town in your notebook. You know, stuff that's more than likely related to spirits causing mischief. Here. Start off by opening your backpack. Good. Next try pressing C to soup. Yeah, I already know how to do that. Is that really your notebook? Are you sure you didn't steal it from a child? Anyway, whatever. Moby told us something about his bathtub growing strange plant matter, right? 
transferring over to Moby's page. There it is. Oh, it's cold. My thingies are cold. One of the locals tells you something that could be related to finding a spirit. That information will be recorded in this book. This way, you don't have to remember everything that is said to you. You good? Okay. Come on, let's face it. I've um, seen brighter, brighter candles burning. Okay. <clears throat> yeah, I know. I know how to do it. Fair. Alright, let's go back to the bathhouse. We have to wash towels. Oh wait, do I have food? Not really. But it's okay. Don't worry about it. It's raining. Not something I can pick up, really. Alright. So that's supposed to be a Tori gate. Is that what it's called? I think so. I'm trying to remember. Alright, let's go open up shop. We got a job to do. Go wash the towels first, and then we can open up. Is my heating not on? Shoot. I'm gonna check it. I guess I'm not allowed to clean. Alright. So can I have more than one? Good job, tree. Sorry to do this to you, tree. <coughs> Excuse me. Wait. Something I wanted to see in there. Okay. Never mind. So... go about cleaning.
Are you going to teach me how to clean? Or did he already? He could have already. I wouldn't know. We're not ready to be open just yet. So... We really do need to clean up, though. And I need to know how. Like, I want to do that. Like, no. Please. Let's look at the state of this place. It's a mess. This game is lovely, though. Like, this is way better than I expected. Come with me, sir. There go. See, and now we can see things. He's super happy. Nice. Okay, so they are color coded then. So red can go next to blue. Is that red? Um, let me see. Is that okay? Nope. Shoot, I messed it up. What about purple? You didn't tell me about purple. Oh, that's what the brushes are for. <gasps> I just figured something out. work. Was that even a brush for people? <laughs> figured out how to clean things. <gasps> oh, lifesaver. I can clean. This one will be happy there. Hang on. Figured out how to clean. Okay. 
Oh, my nose is running. It's a purple man. And then another purple man. There. See, you guys are so happy now. Okay, purple man. See, you look good now. A lot of purple men. You want to do some cleanup though. Like bad. Cleanup needs to happen. Oh, I'm getting so obsessed with this very quickly. I love this game. Come along, sir. <gasps> I need clean towels. Oh no. I'm almost out of clean. I'm out of clean towels. We need them. How many did I have? I'm not talking to you. Oh no, there's no more hot water. Oh no. I knew I should have gone for three. <laughs> I'm sorry about this tree. Not you, Siri. iPod activated. <laughs> I'm so sorry, tree. I'm so sorry. Make your monies, though. It's not going to regrow. Oh, shit. All right, guys. Out of luck. Once this fire runs out, we're done for the day. I thought we figured out how to... Purple man. Okay, so purple man can't go next to red man. Okay, but red and red go together. Shoot, I need more clean towels. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. We're doing good though, holy crap. I'm 
proud of this. Well, while these guys are doing their thing, clean some more. Clean up the towel mat. Can't put clean towels on a dirty mat. Come on now. Look, I'm sorry, guys. Towels are being cleaned. Just don't worry about it. It does get hard to see once it starts getting dark. I'm easily obsessed with this. We're almost out of hot. Oh no! Get the towels done! Oh, we still can! The last guy has ended. So we're gonna go ahead and call it a day. We got money! Do some cleaning now that I don't have to focus on customers. Is it actually dirty or? I don't think it is. Okay, well, since we're out of hot for the day, I'm going to get these washed and they'll be ready to go tomorrow. Okay? And then we can do more cleaning now. Those are washed.
Can you see? I can't. Not very well, anyway. I think it's getting clean. I will come back tomorrow. Excuse me. We'll come back tomorrow. We're getting it. We're getting it. We're doing good. I think. What do you guys think? Is the shop still open by chance? No. Okay. Shop's not open. Mm. I didn't realize I could control how many hours I sleep. lot of monies though. Like holy shit. We did good. Okay. It's only seven. Hey. Excuse me. The shop open yet? Probably not. Ooh. There's wheat. Hey, so what's your name? I may have stolen some of your tea leaves. Oh, hi. Here you are. Okay. Like to eat it. Yum, yum, yum. Yum, yum, yum. Is your shop open yet? That's it. I work here now. What the convenience store. Where was that? I have to have the cat's love. something. He looks quite satisfied. Mm -hmm. Can you bring me a Okay, thank you, Radish. That's nice. Yes. What did I get? I got the wizard. Nice. Where was the convenience store? Oh, it's over there. 
I'm stupid. Okay, I'm not stupid. Are you? Okay. What time do people open? Jeez. I hate it, personally. Where's my cat? Can I buy things yet? No. There you are. Must be 9 o'clock. Okay. Royal milk tea. Dog food. To just leave a bunch of shit hanging around, but it's all yours. I want to pick that stuff. Um, let's go back home real quick. Let's figure out a recipe. I think. That's right, I can store stuff. Come on. I wanted to try that recipe though. It should come out as pizza. It's gonna come out as junk, isn't it? Probably. Anyway, let's go get to work, shall we? Loving this. This is literally the perfect game. I think. <laughs> We're gonna play so much of this. I hope you guys realize. Guys, gals, that days and gays. We need to clean up, okay? Uh. Ugh. Like vomit. <sighs> Suddenly being reminded of Late Night Mom. That was a good game. You should check it out.
was a very lovely game. Very creepy. Because you were in my way, cat, okay? Especially we should clean up around this tub here. Especially if we're gonna be in business. Don't worry about not seeing what I'm doing right now. I know the chat box is blocking it. I'm just cleaning up the dirt. That's all I'm doing. nice and clean next to the tub as it should be I'm using most of my energy right now to fucking clean feels weird feels weird it really does yes I am starting to get tired what a last it's been a long day I have a lot of walking today. Walked about a mile and a half, give or take. It's hard to have customers in here. The tub area should be nice and clean, don't you think? a customer service job because they were sucks. customer service sucks I'm not gonna lie it really sucked I really want to watch spirited away now We gotta do this. We gotta clean. We might as well get it done now, right? While I don't have to focus on peoples. It's only right. Stop it, bestie. 
Please don't stop, actually. Bestie's reacting to the TikTok messages I've sent her. Ugh, excuse me. These are gross. We're almost done. Then we'll finish up towels, you know, all that. We weren't quite done. Are there any others over here? No. There was one right here on the stairs we can't quite use yet. Let's do it. Oh god, I have to clean up in here too. I'm so sorry, tree. Love you though, I promise. What achievement was that? Whatever you say. Oh, stretch. I'm sorry, tree. Promise I love you. Hi there, nice to see you. Bumblebee tuna? Bumblebee tuna! <laughs> Hello, Hope Zoika. <laughs> Welcome in. You thought you couldn't spook me. <laughs> you did it! <laughs> Bitch! <laughs> okay. I want to finish off those towels first. This game is fucking fantastic. Yay! We have all the clean towels. I think we're just gonna run one load of towels to start. We're open for business! Stardew Valley meets Spirited Away. It's perfect. I swear that rug is dirty. But who am I to judge? He's so happy. Purple man. Okay. You have to go over there. You two don't get along. Love the reflection. You can sit next to Purple Man. Because we know you two get along. You can sit next to Red Man. Because you two get along. Yeah. 
The water's cooling. Should be able to do one more cutting. What? Oh no, did I mess it up? I'm sorry to do this tree. <clears throat> okay. Should be good for the day. Another purple man? Jeez. We're getting all the purple mans. Three more towels. How is it getting cold? Should be hot. I'm talking to you. Okay. We have two more towels. We should be okay. <clears throat> Wait, so is that good or is that bad? I'm not sure. Okay, one more towel, and then that'll be the end of it for today. They're all so happy. Okay, that'll be the end of it. Sorry, bro. Sorry. Actually, I know where I need to take this. Oh, fire looks good. up the other one. Thank you. Come again. Looking good in here? Yep. Okay. Sorry guys, that's it for the day. out does that mean they're done yeah sorry guys all done for today oh my roots growing look at that that's nice I 
not have elixirs yet, and I can't cook yet. Oh, it's almost the thing. I love this game so much. Oh, there goes another one. I want to see it reach the thing. Spirituality increased. Now we will see more spirits around town. Nice! What in the blazing boiler was that all about? I leveled up. Mm, you seem different. Spirituality seems to have deepened. The ancient trees sprouting from this bathhouse seems to have rewarded you for serving all of our spiritual bathhouse customers. Well, keep it up. If serving spirits at the bathhouse improves your spirituality, then that means we'll be able to find more customers. I mean, troublemaking spirits around town. It's win-win, really. Feeling very tired. Yeah, well. I'm cold. I forgot. Okay, well done. Yes. Sorry, guys. Closed for the night. Wash this one. So we can't really do any of the washing and drying when... We're not open. You know? But I do want to get some of the cleaning done. I am feeling tired, but someone has to do this. The cat's not going to do it. Yes, okay, shush. It needs to be done. Okay, we'll move on. We'll go to bed. We'll sleep nine hours tonight. Wish my house was a little closer though, because we all forget I'm a dumb dumb. That's right, I emptied out my bag. Oi, rain. Gotta talk. Come on. Dude. This table here. The looks of it. This is where Faye records her commissions. What I mean is, if you interact with this table, then you can request Faye to fix up the bathhouse. Here, take a look. Okay. It's quite simple, really. Okay. Well, first things. Hi, Faye. Hey, Rain. 
Are you looking to commission some work for me? You mean the old building on the mountain? I mean, sure, I can. I don't think anyone owns that property, so I don't foresee any issues. But technically, you'd be sinking money into a property that isn't yours either. Anyway, just interact with my upgrade table anytime, whether I'm out here or not. I look forward to working with you. Off to bed. So is that how I open up more baths? Collected lizard food urine. Yes. I has money. Take a bath. Okay. So I need to go to the shop first, I think. So I could use some tools. Ever tried origami? It's a hobby of mine. Oh, hi Rain. What's new with you? Let's go! We're going to karaoke! I can remember where it is. I think it's over here. Isn't it? Yeah. Doesn't open until nine, huh? Maybe. Let's go. Can I just like go into a room? Welcome to Karaoke Minigame. Okay. Oh. Ah! It's weird.
my god, the focus. Sorry? There you are. No. Later. Thanks for hanging out. We tried karaoke. Need the shop. Okay, cool. Are you guys actually open or what? the shop open? Hello? I, I'd like to buy some shit from ya, but... Go to work, I guess. Anywho. We run a bathhouse for spirits now. That's all we do. That's all we do. Do you want to finish cleaning this room? Like, bad. This clean environment for them is best. Don't you say? I think we got this. We're doing so good already. Excuse me. I kind of feel like puking right now. Getting so sucked into this. <laughs> I love this. This is so lovely. Guys. If the towels will dry without the heat on. Duh, they technically air dry. You were clean after all. There you go. We're almost done in here. Sorry. I think that's all. Is that a goober? No, nope, apparently not. Let's 
Let's get the towels. So we've cleaned up our main room. And let's do it. Oh shoot, we haven't done the heat yet. Shh. Don't worry, man. I got this. Heat is on the way. Shoot, we still have to sweep the floor in here. We're like really bad. You good, bro? Don't worry. Water should heat up soon. I'm sorry about this tree. I'm so sorry. Oops. I feel bad. It's a special tree. And I'm cutting it down. Basically. Water will heat up soon, I promise. Purple man, okay. Should have already had it done, dang it. They like it. Water's warming up. Yeah, the steam is coming. There you guys go. You're doing so good already! Alright, you guys do your thing. I got some sweeping to do. I love this game. So I can only do it four times, it seems. Think. Yeah. Hello, sir. Please come in. Morning, you know, when we run out of towels, that's it for the day. You know, Cat, you could help. Yeah? He wanted me to work here so badly. Think it's clean? It's hard to tell. I think we're good. Who 
closer, please, right this way. Oh, sorry, bud. That's going to be it for the day. It's only three, so should be all right. leave that for now. Everyone's super happy. Okay. Alright, we're doing good. this game. Really do. Oh, I will have to have what's her name uh, fix the place up. Everyone gets a scrub. Sorry, guys. Once these four are done, we are done for the day. Love this art style, though. I mentioned that. to get these towels done ahead of time so that they're ready for tomorrow. We're going to have to go and get more spirits too. We do. Pardon me. Sorry, gents. Give me that towel. Oh, you too. At least everyone got to finish their bath first. You know. The heat's almost out. Those will be ready by tomorrow. Then we're good to go for another day. Let's see. We should go to Moby. What does Moby look like? Excuse me. Rhea is in the apartments. Okay. Where was the apartments again? You guys remember? 
What's over here, though? We haven't gone over here. Oh, it was that. Yeah, we did go over there. Never mind. I forgot, okay? It's busy being a working person. <laughs> oh, I need 2500 Three F. What did you say? Speak up. Say get out of the tub, you crook. Why's my tea green now? It was blue before. My, how indecent of you. The spirit has standards, you know. Are you here? Why wouldn't I be here? This is my home, is it not? This isn't your home, you senile buffoon. Why are you calling senile, you barely levitating fur pig? It's basically what a cat is. <laughs> Wait a minute. I recall calling someone a fur pig before. Many, many times. Eh? Who the hell are you? Incredibly annoying. It looks like you, Baba. Fur pig. Fatty fur pig. Oh! You're Wanyan. And I'm... I was called... Marinoba. Wow. Well. Mori Nova, it's really you. It's been so long. Let's see her you see her yourself again though. Couldn't hurt to have remembered yourself a bit younger. Wanyan, my old friend. What happened to me? Why am I in such an unconventional house and it's this one? It's here is rain. They've been helping me restore things back to normal somewhat. You, like many others, lost your way. But thankfully, you're back with us now. No. No, that's not who I meant. I wondered who you are. Yes, you. You've, um, lost me, Morinova. Magu, is it? How are you involved in all this? Oh, jeez, she's always going on like this. Get a grip. Your brain's getting to be as twisted as your creepy root legs. <laughs> suppose you could be right. I've not been myself for quite some time now. Anyway, like I was saying, we're getting the bathhouse up and running again. You should come by and rest your old bones in a real bath. Are you calling old? If I recall correctly, you're far older, and quite frankly, time has clearly taken its toll. I'll take you up on your offer, though. Ring the bathhouse bell, and I'll hear it. Damned hag. You can always count on her to cause loads of trouble. Speaking of oversized loads, Mori Noba is a large gal. Not all the spirits you encounter will be as small as Aram and Father Og. Better see Fay about repairing one more, more of those overgrown baths. More Inova spirits showing up. We might quickly run out of space in the baths. Okay.
You got it. Okie dokie. Finally. This game is fantastic. I'll keep saying it. Oh, did I already buy it? Anyway, I want a fishing rod. Actually, I can get this too, so. Okay, thank you. Don't have the stuff for it. Damn. Oops. Okay. What's singing with you, me? Woo! Okie dokie. I think I'm going to go ahead and leave it here for tonight. Excellent progress. I think we made it through the most of the tutorial, if not all. This game is fantastic. About as obsessed with it as I am with Pumpkin Panic. Which I want to play some more. <laughs> I really do. I want to get better at it. So. Thank you all so much for hanging out with me. I hope you enjoyed this as much as I did. If you did, don't forget to smash that like button. Subscribe maybe while you're at it. Your choice. Don't forget about Thankmas. Going on right now. Link will be in the description. Donate if you can. Share the link. Or do both. Again, your choice. <laughs> um... As far as I can tell, I'm pretty sure. It's going towards World Central Kitchen again this year. It's our third year running it. Well, no, we're not running it. We're not in charge of it. It's our third year participating in Thankmas. I'm excited. So, do the things. I hope you all have a fantastic night, day, or morning, depending what it is for you. For now, I will see you all next time. Bye-bye!